It is a functional home button adapter for the iPhone 10, which clearly does not have Touch ID or a home button, but don't be fooled. Unfortunately, this is not a fingerprint sensor on here. I wish it was. It kind of looked like one. It's not. It's just a standard home button designed to look like Touch ID. There's nothing to set up here. You just plug it into your iPhone 10, and as you can see, it functions like a home button. You can go into the app switcher. You can unlock the phone from the home screen after authenticating Touch ID or your passcode. You can close out applications. The only thing you basically can't do with this is unlock Siri or actually activate Siri because pressing and holding the home button does not function as Siri, at least on the iPhone 10, which is a little bit unfortunate. But for what you're paying about $20 with Prime shipping, it's a pretty good deal and it's a lot of fun to play with. Now, because you take up the lightning port when you plug this into your iPhone 10, you do have an additional lightning port on the bottom that does function. And next to that is an audio jack. I had high hopes for this. I thought it would simply route the lightning audio to the headphone jack and there would be no quality loss, but at least for the one that I have right here, it was actually abysmal. When I plugged in headphones to here, I could not believe that there was actually no bass, completely non-existent, and the mids were all pushed up to the highest of highs. Everything was ridiculously tinny to the point where a normal song with, with good balance and good mix started to hurt my ears by listening through this specific headphone jack. Now, once again, I don't know if they're all designed this way, but mine was pretty terrible. So if you we're looking to buy this to add a headphone jack to your iPhone 10, which is labeled as one of the features of this product, I would definitely recommend taking a different route. However, if you want to use this as a home button for your iPhone 10, or let's say the home button on a different device like your iPhone 6, 6S, 7, or even iPhone 8 broke, it also works on those devices flawlessly as well. Once again, headphone jack capabilities are very sketchy, but for a home button extender for the iPhone 10 that doesn't have one, or for a device with a broken home button, this is definitely a very valid option. And it works surprisingly well for what you're paying. And as always, I want to hear your thoughts on this product. Could you see yourself using this day to day? Or do you have an iPhone with a broken home button where this could actually and legit